Hey everybody, it's Brian with you from the Game Company. We are playing some more uh, Total War Three Kingdoms, continuing with our Gong Shun Zan campaign. And so we are here. We have this as our ally, and we need to go take on this last bit of territory. So we are almost ready to wipe him out. Um, is there any reason not to just keep pushing forward? You have no movement, so we must have just taken the city at the end of the last episode. That's okay. Uh, you guys are all burned down, so let's go maybe repair this. This is actually all in the city, not in the farmland. What is our food? Our food's actually good right now. Um, what else can we do with our buildings? How's our income? Income's okay. Income's okay. What about our capital? I do want to get you up to, uh, um, small regional city. That's gonna be all of my food. What other options do we have here? Extra income from commerce. Eh, money's fine here. It's not great, though. Yeah, money's fine there, but not great. What else do we got here? That is then going to be the farm. Okay. Um... That is just bumping you up size. I don't think I want to do that. The other thing I started noticing in our live stream is as your cities get larger and larger, uh, you start getting some population issues. Like, people start hating uh, the large population. So you start losing some... Um, like, you can see negative 10 right now. So there's a chance that we're going to have to start building some of the happy buildings in some of these places. You have the city, but you don't have the farmland. We don't want to upgrade the city. Once again, more food production, and then we're going to have to re-switch you over. This is public order. Yeah, that's fine. I think let's go ahead and upgrade our capital. Let's do the regional. It's going to take a little bit of time. It's going to take seven turns, so that's fine. Um, but then we'll work on our food with uh, everything else. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. We must have pillaged you. Uh, we're, what's going to be next, then? We're currently at war with Hung Shao. Yeah, that's right. I declared war on him because of that. Um, also, I should probably look here. Diplomacy, okay. Appointments, yeah. We must have just hit the next tier up if that's popping up. We must have just hit Marquise. Yeah, we must have just hit it then. Uh, What am I looking for? I'm looking for here. We're about halfway to Duke. Okay, that works. Occupation. Capture the enemy capital. Good. Your power increases. Yep. So, yeah, that did just happen. We secured it. Faction development. Okay. Character ranks gained. Okay. We already leveled him. Friendship is forming. Uh, traits gained. Uh, cr got creative. Hmm. Nice. Nice. Uh, character development. And then faction destroyed and diplomacy. Yeah, so, um, what I wanted to look at real quick is diplomacy. Who is, if we did faction grouping, Tao Yang is also in our faction. Tao Ying. So you right here. Lu Bei is not. Oh, Lu Bei is. Hmm, interesting. But Yun Shao is not? Yeah, he's not. But he really likes me. What do you not want? you. Yun Shu. <laughs> I was like, wait a second. This guy doesn't like us. Yun Shu. Hi. Would you like to join? Here's the other thing. Did we ask everyone? Did we try vassalizing everyone? No. Nah, he doesn't want it. Did we try vassalizing everyone yet? Greetings. Let us like, most of these guys aren't going to say yes to this, but we can go, um, try. What about vassalizing you? Nah, because I'm going to... I got to kill you. I got to kill you. Vassalize you. No, all right. Uh, you... Uh, I don't want to invite you. I want to vassalize you. I apparently can't vassalize you, so that's fine. I can't uh, ask you... Uh, the Han is already a vassal. Kongrong. Hey, Kongrong, I would love to vassalize you. Dang it. Come on, Kongrong, man. I want your books. I want your books, man. So, no. If anyone can get close, then that's what we're looking for. Support independence. A lot of these guys are already vassalized. Don't we have a vassal? I think we have a vassal, right? Yeah, none of these guys are particularly close. Now, the thing is, I could look at quick deal, but the thing with the quick deal is it wouldn't necessarily show up. Like, it wouldn't show up if it's not 100%. So, that would only show up if they're 100% ready to be my vassal. And I'm looking for someone that just has a low enough number that we can trade them some stuff and actually make them vassalize with me. Yeah, this is not looking too good for vassalization. Man, none of these guys want to be vassals. Really? Why is everyone so bad about it? Maybe distance. You know, distance probably is having a big deal to do with this. So, the only one really close to us would be Lu Bei. He's actually almost as strong as me. Oh, he is my vassal. Okay. That makes sense. Is he currently my vassal?
Yeah, he is my vassal. Okay, that makes more sense then. Mm, so then Lou Dai, you were just the single province man? I feel like... Our patience I feel like this should be closer than it is. Huh. I feel like that should be a little bit more of a threat. Like, I should have more of a threat, which we should put him a little um, scared. Late. More scared of me. So he wants peace. Yeah, no. You're gonna pay me 5,000 for peace when I'm literally about to murder you? I think not. I think not. We probably need to go move over here. We will invite Shun Yu. Uh, he will say no, though, so that's fine. I don't know if I wanted him in here anyways. Are you really gonna come at me? Do you want to come at me, bro? I will fight you. I will take you on right now. I don't know if I need to build up her army anymore. I don't know if I need to build up her army. Overpopulation, so we got support from Artisans. Congratulations, everybody. Let's go hit this farmland before our ally hits it. Be unrelenting. He got a freaking army again. <laughs> How close can you get these freaking armies, man? So he has no food right now. So I'm just going to starve out. He might actually attack me, which then that's fine. That's fine. But we're just going to starve him out. There's no reason to fight him. There's no reason to rush it out. All right. You have a bunch of options here. Um, I would like probably this one because we can afford it. What does this one give us? These are all lots of money buildings. I'm going to go with that one for now. Yeah. Yeah. And that'll probably be my turn. I, cannot. I could put him here just to guard the river pass, but I don't mind him coming across, because then I can hit him in two ways. Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do with her yet. I hadn't decided yet. Can I, like, put her back as a spy? I wonder. Kongrong, non-aggression pack. Yeah, I'm okay with that for now. We have finished. I'm not really interested in killing Kongrong. He should be a little further east than we're, uh, uh, like, he's a little further east right now than we're going to be worrying about. Theoretically. Because Kongrong should be, uh, like, right up here. Wang Lang got destroyed. Okay. So, yeah, he should be up here somewhere. Where are you going, bud? Surely he's not going down for this farmland. Surely not. I am at one again. To war! Yeah, I'll stay there. I'm gonna move her down here. And I'm gonna probably push towards the town. Uh, most likely what's gonna happen is I'm gonna clear this out and then maybe go push back up north because we're gonna remove basically everyone who threatened us or who is gonna threaten us because I mean Lou Dai doesn't like us but everyone else around us is pretty positive so and Lou Dai is not gonna go declare war on me like come on come on so he actually wants me to f come fight him he has no military right now still just says decisive Eh, he's got a decent sized garrison there What's the map? Oh, it's on the field. All right, screw it, fight it. Actually, I thought it was around a city, so since it's just a field fight, let's just fight it. Let's just oh, fight sir. it. The white horse Rides white to horse. battle. Sweet. Sweet. It is my honor to lead you into battle. <laughs> okay, I'm glad. I'm glad you're honored. Come on, load up. Let's do this. Now, since this is our main army, this is why we're fighting the battle. Mostly because I just don't want to take a bunch of extra casualties that are unnecessary. I'd rather just fight this myself. So, uh, don't freeze game. That would be bad. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Continue. Um, yeah, they don't have a town. They don't have a town. That's an interesting map. That's a very interesting map. I really dig it. I really, really dig it. A lot of little terrain issues, too. So, uh, okay. We know what we're doing because we've done this about 4,000 times. Uh, let's go put you guys on three. Um, and then let's put all of you guys G infantry. We should look at maybe upgrading some of our units. I'm not super concerned about that yet, too. Do any of these guys have... Ooh, what does he have? Spear wall. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. And then we also have shield wall, too. Nice. Okay, so we do have some higher tier uh, formations then. Uh, you guys go on four. I think I'm going to put the cav over here in the forest. Yeah, we'll just hide them all there. And then you guys go on one. 
Okay, and I can put you on five. Doesn't really matter. Uh, okay, so what do we want to do? We want to put three up here. Do three like this. What? Oh, because of the terrain. Oh, interesting. Hmm. How about here? Do something like that. And then we'll put the cav next to him. That should be fine. Two then, let's shift over. Something like this will be fine. Uh, five, we'll shift you guys like right there. And then we'll just put one like here. Actually, one to one, but that's fine. Okay, we should be good to go. Hopefully, these guys are within range. They are. Is there a reason not to flame these? I don't think so. I don't think so. Let's flame it up. Let's freaking flame it up. Let's freaking go for fire. <laughs> okay, I'm good. I'm good. Dude, you poor guys, man. I don't even I don't even think you know what's coming for you. Oh yeah, you had no idea what was coming for you. You had no idea what was coming for you. Did we just murder their entire army? No, I think they I think they got hidden. I think they got hidden because of the hill. I was like, did we literally just like wipe them out with one shot? <laughs> That's what it kind of looks like. Yeah, they're hiding because of the hill. Freaking hills, man. Wow. Well, that was quick. Yeah, that was quick. Oh, we're actually shooting arrows already. That's a cav. Um, let's go put you guys up here. Yeah, let's get you guys up there, because we can go uh, do shield wall and stuff like that. Oh my god, that's just nasty. That is just... That's just psycho. Like, I don't care. I don't care who you are. This is just, like, terrible. Terrible. Uh, let's take you and then let's have you guys hit here and We'll probably spread them out a little bit and let's actually get you guys coming up here come do something like that uh, Two hold up hold up hold up. We got to uh, put everyone in formation. So spear wall that's against charge, but it lowers the range block Uh. All right, that's the alarm. Why is the alarm going off? <laughs> I think I'm going to try that. Hopefully that's a one-time thing with the alarm. I don't know if you guys heard that or not. Because it wasn't talking. Yeah, let's try Let's try this. Sh um, let's let's try the uh, pike thing. Shut up and die. Nah, I should do this one. Yeah, these guys are ready to go. With the shield wall. Beautiful. Hold the line! Alright, alright, alright. So we don't need you on this. And then we're gonna go grab both of these guys and then just get you guys over there. Uh, threes, you guys can just go focus down these guys. Um, these guys can go hit here. Let's do it this way. I want five on you uh, and then three on you. And hopefully we don't hit our cab. That's basically the goal right here. You guys are going to uh, go back to normal formation. Okay, the alarm is apparently still going off. I wonder what that's beeping for. You come here. You come here, and then come there. We could probably just fight this on manual. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna turn you guys off for the time being. Halt. If you guys want to shoot those guys, that's fine. You guys get up here. And then, same thing with you guys. Just halt and turn off Togo Skirmish. And But not Skirmish. Yeah, you have Fire at Will off. Alright, so then these guys are fine. Uh, hey, you guys want to go shoot these guys? They're just wiping everyone out. Alright, you just get in here and just break this. Yeah, let's just come here and break this. I didn't even use my generals yet. Hi, get in there. Probably should just keep them up on HP. I'm surprised these guys actually held as long as they did. Do the debuff so that they break a little quicker, and then there's the morale. Actually, what's your debuff? Cooldown of abilities. Oh, no, no. Negative armor. Oh, yeah, and then you guys are just going to get wrecked. Do, oh, we do have a uh, wedge formation. Yeah, that was an instant one. So it doesn't matter because this is for the win. So I'm just going to claim it. Because they're all going to die anyways since it's their last little territory. So goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah, that's pretty good. 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 I think we're fine. I think we're fine. I need to go look at that alarm, but... 
I don't really want to put a pause in the episode. Let's see how many more times it beeps. <laughs> so, Reason give me... Give me the replenishment. He would join me. He is defiant, though. I'm gonna execute him. I'm gonna execute him. He's no one special. He's not even legendary. I'm just gonna execute him. Uh, alright. I'm gonna go check the alarm. One sec. Okay. Apparently console modem failure or something. I have no idea. So the she or educated gentlemen are a rare breed that exemplify everything that the Han citizen should aspire to. One such man is identified, idealized by his local community as bringing harmony and inspiration to everyone around him. Character recruit estimated salary 100. All right, fine. Uh, Path of Glory, destroy the following factions. Good. Ah, sweet, sweet, sweet. So that gives us extra growth, extra public order, which is really nice. Is that permanent? No, five turns. And then income from peasantry. And then we destroy the faction. Good, 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 good. Now we gotta destroy the Shao Shao. Sao Shao. Sao Shao Zao Shao? Zao Zao? I don't know. I've heard like literally four different things from people. So, um, probably gonna say it wrong. So, like, whatever you think it is, I'm probably gonna say it wrong from that. <laughs> uh, invoke council, please. Grain storage. All right. Send Liang Zexa. Who are you? Are you Liang Zexa? You. I have to do what? And then Solomon administration. Uh, what was that? On any assignment. Hmm. Okay. Do we have extra assignments waiting? Ah, we do. We do. We do. Okay, that's easy. Food production. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's see who has the most food. Will these work? Dang it, they don't work. Uh, so that's eight food. Six. Ah, uh, that's a lot of food. All right, found it. Congratulations. Give me extra food production. And then that's going to be the mission. Probably will take one more turn, I guess, before it uh, registers, but sure. Sure, sure, sure. We've got a lot of potential buildings here. Assignments, yeah, we actually have one more assignment available as well. Um, this is, where's our capital? Wait, weren't we upgrading you? <gasps> I was upgrading the wrong one. I don't want to upgrade you, I want to upgrade our capital. Yeah, I don't want to upgrade you. So let's do that then. Yeah, because I want my capital upgraded, Brian. Brian, Brian, Brian. Construction cost and construction time and building upkeep. Ah, that actually seems like a really good thing. I'm gonna do that because we're about to spend a butt ton of money on this. So lowering the construction cost on that seems pretty okay. Um, I don't want to overbuild right now because we don't have so much money. So let's do food production here. Because we need to... Oh, that was a lot of money. I need to have 6,500. So I can maybe build one more building right now. Um, not gonna upgrade you. 3,700... Is too much. I will repair you. I think I need to save. I think we need to save then. Yeah, I think we save from where we're at. Money's still really good though. Yeah, really excited with how good our money is. So assignments, mission issued, mission issued, 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 uh, destroyed, whatever, local hero, occupation, we already know about that, commandery secured, we got a wooden ox, great. Okay, character development, buildings, and faction destroyed. Uh, are any characters really pissy with us? Two. Do we have any extra followers? Yeah, not one that's going to make you happier with me. And then you could use something like here. Here, take a little bit more satisfaction. There you go, congrats. Uh, actually, was your thing giving you satisfaction? Yeah, actually, yes. Okay, that's fine. Next turn. Next turn. Let's see where his army is going to go. Who are you? Surely I'm not at war with you. I don't think I'm at war with you. you not aggression pack with Dong Mean. You're down there. And you're going to pay me 1300 Total. I'm good. I will take two things I love in this game. Taking money to... He has two armies here. Taking money... To fight a war across the world that I'll never participate in, or taking money to peace someone out. 
<laughs> and then also taking money for non-aggression packs. All these are wonderful. Tao Ying is now Xiao Xiao. Uh, you signed a peace treaty. Okay. We got our supports. Uh, while res resettling the people, your attendant comes upon an issue and requests your judgment. A couple living in the local area has refused to move, claiming that this has been their home for generations. So we could leave them. And because I'm gracious, actually, no, I can't. Literally, all I can do is force them to move and spend money. Well then, that sucked. Unify in one direction. I must refuse. No. Yeah, he's got two armies right now. I have returned. Have my generals report. Gather your strength. How big is this garrison? It's a decent sized garrison. He can actually hit. Bring me news of the province. So get you here. I don't know if you'll actually end up in the city or not, but I will have no problem fighting this army 1v1. I don't think. And then we were still getting the positive here. Yeah, we still have the balance of power. If I move her here, would she join? Yes. Okay, and then how does that looking? Gives me a balance of power, but not great. I'm going to go ambush. And I'm going to put her right on the coast. So hopefully she joins. Hopefully she joins. We are losing military supplies, but it should be fine. It's winter, so that's why you always lose military supplies. All right, all right, all right. Capital, capital, capital. I need you to go up a tier. Sweet. So you're going to become a regional. Yeah, small regional city. That's what I want. Good. 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 We still got 30, uh, 3, 3,900. So let's go build something. Uh, don't want to upgrade you because food's going to be really bad here in a second. Extra income from industry. Sounds good. Sounds good. Anything that's going to give us money at this point. Who are you? Lube. Am I at war with Lube? Lube. Which one's Lube? That's Lude. Day. Am I at war with Lube? Lube. Lube. Are you my... You're my vassal. Yeah, Lube is my vassal. So, let's try doing something. Go Diplomacy. I want to go Lube. Hi. Welcome. I can't war coordinate with you? As my vassal, I can't war coordinate with you. Huh. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. I guess we'll live without the war coordination. Uh, 22 minutes, okay. We're gonna keep these episodes a little bit, like, right on time, right around 30 minutes, just because I got a lot, uh, uh, I gotta do still, so. See, the other problem is a lot, they use a lot of the same Zhang Yan, list to leave our coalition. <gasps> no! Oh, that's Yan. That's fine. Wait, where are you at? No, that is our guy! <gasps> uh oh. Uh oh. Well, I guess we know what we're gonna be doing now. I guess we know what we're gonna be doing. Going and killing him. I wonder if I could piece this guy out. Yeah, that's bad. He is weaker than us. He is weaker than us. Can I declare on him? Oh, I actually don't have anyone in a faction now. Dang, dude. That sucks. I got too powerful. <laughs> if I declare on you... Lots of people are not going to like me. Uh, I mean, I think we got to unify for the sake of China, right? I think that's the goal. So the only thing I would like to say is can we peace out... The dude we're at war with. Hung Xiao. Hi, would you peace out? Yes. So I'm just going to request money, and I'm totally cool with this. He's going to pay me a lot of money for this, too. I was going to move his direction, but there's no reason to now. This is actually going to be really good income. Uh, so 2300 23, 22,300. That might be a little too much. Uh, 22,000, 22. Oh my gosh, 200. Oh my gosh. Okay, I know what I'm doing. 2,300. That's what's 2,300. There we go. Proposed deal. Deal signed. Okay, so now we're at peace with him. His army's currently in our territory. That's fine. 
So instead, what we're going to do is we're just going to get ready to go murder this guy. He pieced me out at his own um, cost. So he's got territory there, there. Can we see his army? Not possible. Not possible. Why do we still have vision on him? I don't know. I wonder if this is worth it. I think so. I think let's do it. I think let's do it. Let's go send him a spot. I have no idea why we have vision on his entire territory. So can we see where his armies are? I think it's just this guy right here and then this guy right here. And you're Lu Bei, which is our vassal? No. Zhang Yang. And then him. So he's got three armies. He's got three armies, but one is only a two stack. So he is almost as powerful than me. As powerful as me. The thing is, his dudes are all in the wrong position right now. Yeah, he is in definitely a terrible position to uh, go against me right now. Copper mine and city. Is it this one? No, it's that one right there. Ooh, okay. So we might just bypass the copper mine right now. And I might go for this large town. And then this farmland. Yeah, I think that's what we want. So I need you to replenish. So go back to normal. And let's get over here. And congratulations. Thank you for piecing me out. And then I think we're just going to go hit. I think we're making more than enough money. That I will go ahead and recruit with her. And who do we want to pull into this army? She is a sentinel. She's a tax collector? Hmm. Hmm. Meh. She's a sentinel. Excels at locking down enemy generals or holding a checkpoint. Okay. So, what I'm looking for is I definitely need a strategist. She hates me, though. And that's probably not going to go away, but I don't really have another strategist, so I think I'm going to have to take her. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to take her. And then we're going to want two catapults. Yeah, and then who else do we want? We still have a little bit of money. Uh, You're a champion. Yeah, I think I want a champion, probably. The level 4 champion? Where'd you come from? Kongrong? I don't care if Kongrong spying on me. <laughs> yeah, it's like, I could care less if it's Kongrong spying on me. Alright, so this is going to hurt my income quite a bit. The fact is, remember, we're making what? How much off our trade dealer right now? How much are we making off uh, the Hong Shua, Hong Shao trade deal? Can we see previous deals? Two point nine. So we're actually losing money then. I think right now. Too many people in this army. Mhm. Mm but it's okay. This is what we had to do. It's what we had to do. That's not my army. That's his army. Uh, switch from ambush. And you're fully stocked, right? Yeah, so I can go here and do March. Although, actually, it doesn't matter, does it? I don't know if it matters or not. Let's unmarch first. Try this normal. See where you can end up. Okay, so now if I march you... Does that give me any more speed? No, literally does nothing. So we'll just do normal stance. Okay, okay, okay. I need income. I'm gonna need income here, bud. I'm gonna need income. Uh, satisfaction for Sentinels. Eh. Uh, income from Peasantry. Maybe. Trade influence. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, trade influence. Maybe. Public order. Eh, eventually. Public order. Eh. Income from all sources. Yeah. 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 Let's do this. We can get the income from all sources. All right. That'll give me just a tiny bit of money, but that should be okay for now. Uh, but we're going to wrap this episode up here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like, comment, let me know what you think. The other thing to keep in mind now that I'm doing the exit <laughs> uh, is we can actually do assignments for money. Because right now we're doing like construction costs, which, you know, whatever. I can actually cancel this. And maybe get someone in here that will actually um, do construction or, or do something that will actually make me money. So that's probably one way. But anyways, if you enjoyed it, drop a like, comment, let me know what you think. As always, hit the subscribe button, join the game, comment, share your support. I will see you guys next episode. Hi, I want the book.
Give me the campaign movement range. Yeah. She still hates me? No, she has a grudge against Zan. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, is that any extra movement? No, not this turn. Not this turn. Uh, okay, character development, buildings. Okay. All right, I'll see you later. Bye, everyone.